hi everyone and welcome to my channel today we will do this interesting question we are given a right angle triangle right angle at c and ca is equal to cb given d is the midpoint of ca it is given cd is equal to da length of ab the hypotenuse is given as 4 cm and this inscribed triangle def is given as an equilateral triangle and we have to find the area of this shaded triangle, this equilateral triangle DEF. I tried it with pure geometry method, but in the end, in the last step, I have used trigonometry. We need some constructions to solve this question. If we rotate this triangle FDC about point D with N clockwise rotation 60 degree so this c will be over here and this df will coincide with this side de on the other hand for this construction we can say that draw ep as equal to cf and draw dp as equal to dc let us suppose this point bp for the sake of simplicity this dc is Rotate it means this must be C dash, but I am taking P and this is 90. So this is 90. This P and CF are equal and this DC and DP are equal. As we are given that these two sides are equal, this is 90. So these two angles will be equal and each will be 45, 45. This angle is equal to this angle. Let us suppose this is theta. So if this is theta, this will also be theta and this is 60 minus theta because this FDE is 60 degree. The whole angle is 60. This is theta because these two are congruent triangles by construction or by rotation. This will be 60 minus theta and this whole thing is 60. If this is 60, then this angle will be 120. This angle is 120 from here to here it is 120 by using Pythagorean theorem this CA square plus CB square is this 4 square and CA CB are equal so twice of CA square is 16 so CA square is 8 CA is equal to root 8 root 8 means 2 root 2 but D is the midpoint of CA so CD is equal to half of CA that is 2 root 2 by 2 so CD and DA are root 2 root 2 each and dc dp are equal so therefore dp will also be root 2 in quadrilateral aepd this is 120 degree this is 45 this is 90 so this will be sum of these three and then subtracted from 360 this will we will find this is 105 this angle is equal to 105 now if we join ap this triangle DAP will be an isosceles triangle because this DA is equal to root 2 and DP is equal to root 2. This angle is 120 so these two angles will be equal. We can say that this is 180 minus 120 is 60. 60 divided by 2 30 30 each. So this is 30. This will also be 30. And since this full angle is 45 this is 30 so this will be 15 only now we can do this in two ways either we can use sign rule to get this ap or we can drop a perpendicular and then it will be 60 we can use 30 60 90 theorem from d we have drawn dq perpendicular to ap since dq is common in both and da dp are equal this is 1990. So these two triangles are congruent. This is 60 and this is 60. This is root 2. This is root 2. This is 30, 60, 90 triangle. So we can find this AQ. This AQ is side opposite to 60 degree. Length of AQ is root 3 by 2 times of hypotenuse. Since AQ is equal to QP, therefore AP is twice of AQ. Therefore, we can say that AP is equal to root 6. And now, after getting the area of this 
equilateral triangle can be found by using root 3 by 4 side square. So the main target is how to find DE. And if, if we find PE, then we will use Pythagorean theorem to get this DE. So I tried but I couldn't find the geometrical method how to find this PE. So I am going to use trigonometry. So using sign rule, PE over sine 15 is equal to AP over sine 105. Sine 105 is equal to sine 90 plus 15 that is cos 15 and this sine 15 over cos 15 is tan 15. So PE is equal to AP we found root 6, root 6 tan 15. To get the value of tan 15, this 15 can be rewritten in the way 6. 45 minus 30 and then use tan a minus b formula we will get root 6 into root 3 minus 1 over root 3 plus 1 if we rationalize the denominator we will get root 6 into 2 minus root 3 this is the value of p now by Pythagorean theorem DE square is equal to DP square which is 2 plus PE square root 2 square which is 2 plus this square is 6 and 2 minus root 3 square that is equal to 2 plus 6 4 plus 3 minus 4 root 3 that is equal to 2 plus 6 7 minus 4 root 3 and that is equal to 2 plus 42 minus 24 root 3 finally 44 minus 24 root 3 so area triangle DEF is equal to root 3 by 4 into side d square already we found d square value is this so that is root 3 by 4 if we take 4 common it will be 11 minus 6 root 3 this 4 and 4 will get cancelled root 3 is multiplied here so 11 root 3 and root 3 into root 3 is 3 into 6 minus 18. So 11 root 3 minus 18 centimeter square. This is the exact value, exact area of this triangle. Which on further simplification, 1.053 centimeter square. That is the answer.